respected Shri Pranam Mukherjee, Honorable President of India and President of both Indian Red Cross Society and St. John MLS India Sir, Shri Jagat Prakash Nada, Honorable Chairman of Indian Red Cross Society and St. John MLS India and Honorable Union Minister of Health and Family Welfare Government of India, Honorable Governor of Uttarakhand, Vice Chairman of Indian Red Cross Society and Vice Chairperson of St. John MLS India, members of the Managing Body and National Council of the two organizations, officers of the Ministry of Health and Family Welfare, Ms. Mary Betts, the Head of Regional Delegation, ICRC, invited representatives of the partner organizations and national societies, awardees, delegates, guests, observers, ladies and gentlemen. At the onset, let me welcome you all present here today and thank the Honorable President for agreeing to preside over the ceremonial session of our annual general meeting. A special welcome to those who are going to receive awards today. You are torch bearers in the field of service to humanity. This recognition to you will enthuse many more volunteers to undertake similar activities. I also welcome those who have taken pains to travel to New Delhi from branches and centers all over the, from all over the country. With these words, while welcoming you all once again, Indian Red Cross Society and St. John MLS India rededicate themselves to service to humanity, especially to alleviate the suffering of honorable people under the able guidance and leadership of our honorable chairman and honorable president. Thank you. Shri Pranab Mukherjee Ji, Honorable President of India, Honorable Governor of Uttarakhand, Shri Dipinder Singh Huda, Vice Chairman of Indian Red Cross Society, Dr. Mrs. Kamla Gidwani, Vice Chairperson of St. John Ambulance India, Dr. S.P. Agrawal, Secretary General of Indian Red Cross Society, and St. John Ambulance India. Mr. Simon Misiri, head of the Regional Delegation of Indian Federation of Red Cross and Red Crescent Societies, Mrs. Mary Werns, head of the Regional Delegation of the International Committee of the Red Cross members of the Managing Body and National Council of the two organizations, awardees, distinguished guests, ladies and gentlemen. I am very pleased to join you here today for the ceremonial session of the annual general meeting of the Indian Red Cross Society and St. John Ambulance India. First of all, on behalf of the Indian Red Cross Society and St. John Ambulance, I would like to thank Honorable President for agreeing to preside over this ceremonial session of our annual general meeting. Ladies and gentlemen, in conclusion, I would like to use this opportunity to thank once again our Honorable President, for this support to both organize, for his support to both the organizations. His presence in this important event and his inspiring words will encourage us to further build our organization capacity and refine our auxiliary role in the government for better services to the vulnerable people of this country. I once again congratulate and thank all the branches and volunteers for their commitment and energy in serving their communities. Thank you, Jai Hind. We'll start with Red Cross gold medal. For the year 2012 and 13, Sri Balakrishna Sidula from Andhra Pradesh. Sri Dinesh Gupta, Jammu and Kashmir. For the year 2013 and 14, Dr. Harish L. Meetha from Tamil Nadu. Dr. Deepak Mohan Bhai Narola from Gujarat. Now we move on to Rajkumari Amritkaur Medal of St. John Ambulance India for the year 2012 and 13, Sri P.S. Naidu from Karnataka. And for the year 2013-14, Sri Ravi Kumar Kher from Delhi. Now we move on to Jeev Raksha Medal for the year 2013 and 14, Sri Bashir Ahmed Sheikh from Jammu and Kashmir.
St. John Ambulance India Gold Medal for the year 2012 and 13, Dr. Mukesh P. Jagiwala from Gujarat. For the year 2013-14, Srimati Minakshi Lakshmi Narayanan from Tamil Nadu. Fundraising and Membership Shield for the year 2012 and 13, the first position among the state branch goes to Andhra Pradesh. And among the UT branch, Chandigarh UT branch. And for the year 2013-14, the first position among the state branch goes to Andhra Pradesh. the UT branch, the first position goes to Chandigarh UT branch. <laughs> Fundraising and membership shield for the year 2012 and 13, the second position goes to Odisha. <laughs> and for the year 13-14, the second position goes to Gujarat. <laughs> Highest number of voluntary blood collection shield for the year 2012 and 13 goes to Gujarat. For the year 2013 and 14, it goes to Gujarat again. Now the shield for highest number of blood collection vis a -vis population. For the year 2012-13, goes to Dadra and Nagar Haveli. And for the year 2013-14, Dadra and Nagar Haveli. St. John Ambulance India, the membership shield for the year 2012 and 13 goes to Haryana. For the year 2013-14, West Bengal. Now the St. John Ambulance India Training Shield for the year 2012-13 goes to Haryana. And for the year 2013-14, it goes to Haryana again. Good morning. Sri J.P. Nanda. Minister of Health and Family Welfare, Chairman, Indian Red Cross Society, and St. John Ambulance, India. Sri Ajij Kureshi, Governor of Uttarakhand, Sri Dipendar Huda, MP, Vice Chairman, Indian Red Cross Society, Dr. S.P. Agrawal, Secretary General, Indian Red Cross Society and St. John Ambulance, India. Dr. Ms. K. Gidwani, Vice President, St. John Ambulance, India. Distinguished representatives of Red Cross and St. John Ambulance. Distinguished guests, distinguished awardees, ladies and gentlemen. I'm indeed very happy to be present amidst you on this occasion when we are having the ceremonial session of the general <coughs> body meeting of Indian Red Cross Society and St. John Ambulance. At the very outset, I would like to extend my warm felicitations to the Indian Red Cross Society and the St. John Ambulance India, I congratulate them for their selfless service and their humanitarian work in all parts of Indian society. Ladies and gentlemen, Gandhiji used to observe, I quote, the best way to find yourself is to lose yourself in the service of others." Unquote. I call upon all those present here today to reflect on these words. Let each one of us seriously consider making a contribution, big or small, to support and supplement the noble efforts of the government and organizations such as the Red Cross and St. John Ambulance in the service of our people. With these words, I once again 
congratulate Honorable Health Minister Sri J.P. Nanda, Dr. S.P. Agarwal, and all other office bearers of the Indian Red Cross Society and St. John Ambulance. I wish you a success in your annual general meeting and all your future endeavors. Thank you, ladies and gentlemen. Jai Hind.